Hey everybody, welcome back to Mr. Blue's blind playthrough of Lone Survivor. Let's continue up, because if I remember correctly, the last thing that happened was I was killed by Spider-Man. So that doesn't sound like a lot of fun. I'm going to see if I can't take him down this time around. I have a lot of ammo. Is my gun full? My gun is empty. Reload that thing. Alright. Let's see if Mr. Man on the radio has anything for me. He does not. Then I'm not gonna go visit him, there's no point. Alright, let's see if I can't take those guys down now that I know they can Spider-Man leap onto the ceiling. Alright, I believe it was... this side? So hungry. Put the gun away. Uh, let's see what foods we got. Got full rotting meats. Eat the crackers. Good. Not this side, the other side. Yes, this side. Alrighty then. One guy down. The other guy will turn into Spider-Man. Or not for some reason. Oh, he punched me. I took a lot of hits. Alright, those guys are down. I think there's one more. Now, if I remember correctly, that should be all of them, and I can't reload anymore, so I'm hoping that's all of them. Creepy noises, turn on my flashlight, see if there's anything I missed over here. Not looking like it, except for the hole. Okay, that's the hidey hole. Good! I took them all out. Hopefully, I need to unlock it. Is this the room right below me? These favorite cool things. They seem to be talking about a victim of an accident. Apparently, the unnamed victim died in a bomb blast. The victim was a civilian in some war. No idea which war it's talking about. Wars are long since over. Now it's just survival. Um. That's odd. That's very odd. Before I scope that out, I'm going to go back and save because I don't want to have to go through and shoot all those guys down again. Considering I only got hit once, it actually feels pretty good that. I didn't get killed on the way down there. Didn't do much good, but it did save the game. Let's see if he has anything now that's the next day. Still doesn't have anything special. Alrighty then, well I need to eat. So I'm going to combine the cheese with... Cheese crackers. And I'm going to munch on those. Alright. See if I can't use this to go back to the area that I just came from, or if it's going to send me to the other side. Sweet. Apartment 101. Instant coffee. Uh, dried squid on a stick. Yummy. He doesn't really want to go down the alleyway back. Alright, I'll give him that. Let's check this way, see if there's anything. Can't open it. Hmm. How much ammo does my gun have? Six rounds. I can at least kill one thing. Pull this out just in case. In the event that something creepy happens. Um. Flashlight, no. Flashlight. What's happening? Uh, people. Man. He's weird. Is that the G-Man? Did I appear from nowhere? Um, I don't know what you're saying. I don't really like it either. Creepy man. Looks like the G-Man. Although, I don't think the G-Man had a blue tie. Okay, so I'm apparently going to meet this guy three times before he finally helps me. 
Oh, I don't know who he is, but he left me a can of soda. Oh wait, there's something inside of it. A fire door key. A fire escape. Handgun ammo. Why did he give me handgun ammo unless everything's changed? Reload this gun. Alright, how much ammo do I have? Six spare bullets along with the battery's almost out. Good thing I have another battery. Uh, ten rounds, so I have a total of sixteen bullets. That's good for about three enemies, I'd say. Just hoping I don't have to use it. Now, it said fire door key, so hopefully that means fire escape. That's what I'm thinking it might mean. Sweet! Wait, I have the key, don't I? Fire door key. Oh, maybe if I examine this thing. Unlocks fire doors on the first floor of the wing court. Oh, okay, so I'm back down on the first floor. Uh, pull up my map. Fire doors, fire doors, fire doors, fire doors. Uh, wing court. Wait a minute. Is this whole building called the wing court? Because if so, does that mean there's multiple buildings? Because if so, dear god. I need to get... There's the question mark up there. I'm not sure where I have to go. All I know is I want to go to sleep and save first. Snooze! Didn't do much good. I'm still wondering if I'm able to die of hunger or whatnot. Because if so, that would really suck. No, no, I don't need to sleep again. Eat. Squid on a stick. It's calamari. It's calamari, dude. Stop complaining. Critters, stuff's good. Alright. I have ammo, which makes me nervous. So, flashlight. How much battery power is left on that thing? 47. It's, that's alright. It's not, it's not too bad. Okay, so it opens this door. I heard noises in that other room, meaning the monsters, I think, respawned either that or they came back to life. Alright, I used the key on all the doors I needed it for. I hear a creature. Ah, missed the space. Alright, it's two down. Yeah, what is that? What is that? It's, just, it's squiggly and I don't like it. this room. Right, there's a mirror in here, that's good. Look at the dusty mirror. Look deeply into it. See if I can't go back and eat something. This is me, playing cautiously because I don't want to die. I have a fruit salad. Need a can opener. Who puts the fruit salad in a can? Um, just eat the crackers. Just crackers, yes. That's all. Alright, I'm gonna go save again because I kill off those two monsters. I'm not sure if they'll respawn or not. Hopefully not. But it seems like that hallway would be a lot safer if they stayed dead. So I don't want to have to die and go kill them again. So I'm gonna save there. Uh, go back into the mirror. Look deeply into it. Inexplicably teleportation device. Or inexplicable teleportation device. Damn, Flash, I need a new battery. Something big behind this door, something I've not seen before. Hey, it rhymes. I can't go through this way. Hey, 